Hey yo, what's up? This is Volky, and uh, I'm gonna teach you how to A Tech people in Yu Gi Oh! Forbidden Memories. I don't know how you got here, I don't know uh, why you're playing this game, but you know, you're playing it, and you're like, and you're doing campaign, and uh, there's a uh, the, the final run of the game, you gotta do these like six battles, and they're all like super hard and like not fair at all. You know, it's like ridiculous. Like, Kanam. <laughs> Kanam. <laughs> Come on, Konami 1996. What are you thinking? So, to beat these people, you're gonna need to get uh, support cards, right? Support and equip cards and um, trap cards. And the only way to get these cards is if you uh, power and teching people. Um, so when you power people, you just defeat them as quickly as you can. Like, that's it. It's pretty simple. And you should do that fine uh, when you progress with the game, right? Uh, but teching people, you gotta make sure either they, like, they run out of cards or you gotta do something like super specific, uh, specific to uh, achieve the cards that you want. Not just in this game, but in life. So, uh, but th the way to do it, it, it like sucks, and it's terrible, and um, I want to tell you about it, okay? Alrighty, so, uh, going through the game, right? This is the regular order of the game, you already know that, that's why you're here. For you uh, tech people, you should get some decent fusions, and uh, you should face this dude, like, a good amount of times. Like, I faced him a lot, you know, but like, normally, you should face him, like, I'd say, like, maybe, I'd say maybe like 200. That, you know, and then you should get like, you know, Gaia's and Cursed Dragons and Dark Magicians and shit like that, and, and you'll be, you'll be, you'll be suave. But if you want to get trap cards and shit, you gotta tech this dude, Isis, and then maybe Kaiba. But mostly just Pegasus, you know. Um, so how do you do that? How do we S tech people, okay? So, the way I, uh, I did it was I made the person run out of cards. But I found out by doing research on the internet that there are new ways to, to do that, okay? So I'm going to tell you some of them. Okay, so if you want to S-Tech people, uh, you're gonna need 37 cards used. You need to have uh, below 6,000 HP, uh, one equip card used, four pure magic, and then one trap or more. Like, the one trap is super specific. Oh, and then have, uh, if you're gonna fuse, like, 10 times, have, like, four effective attacks. If you're gonna fuse, like, 15, 17 times, you don't need any effective attacks. But I usually always get them just, uh, just cut. This is the deck that you should have. So you should aim for a lot of fusions, okay? Um, so I mostly run, like, a dragon, uh, like, a twin had a, like, thunder dragon deck. Like, obviously, that's just, like, the standard thing that you do. Um, so just have a lot of dragons, you know, baby dragons, black fire. You can get all this shit from Metal Mage, by the way. So all this shit you can get from Metal Mage. Um, just by like, powering him. So just like, you know, go punch him in the jail. I'm sorry, that's copyright. I can't, I can't say that. I'm into Dark Magicians just in case like, shit gets like, real and I can't deal with it. Um, and then the rest are just like, Thunders, you know. If, what I recommend, if you have like, um, higher level cards, like if you have like, like I have like, more, uh, Black Fire line, Black, Whatever. Take your higher end dragons and make them smaller because two dragon, like a dragon and a thunder and a dragon will make twin and a thunder dragon. And that's uh, two fuses right there. Great text. And then um, these. You should have uh, one, two, three, four. Four um, pure magic cards and these are like just change field cards. So have four of those, have at least one equip and then the more traps you can get the better. So this part sucks, okay? To get one trap, you would have to, uh, you would have S Tech Kaiba, okay? And, uh, Kaiba is, is, well, why am I telling you? You know that. You know who Kaiba is. You're playing this game. Come on. <laughs> no casual, but just pick up this game. Uh, so you gotta S Tech him, and the way you do that is, uh, you gotta make him run out, run out of cards. And that takes so fucking long. It takes. It took me like five fucking hours, I, I don't think I'm exaggerating that, to get as a trap hole. 
you do it is um, you place like a low level monster, confuse, and then uh, try to the monster down the house that you change, and then can run out of cards before you. It like it takes so long, and it just takes so long, and I hate it. And it takes so once you get one trap hole, things get so much faster. It's so nice, speeds everything up, makes you so happy, and um, I don't cry at nights anymore, which is great. Have a bunch of dragons, lower level. Have some spellcasters because they fuse with dragons. Uh, have a metal dragon? I don't know. He's just there. Uh, thunders. I should probably take this guy out. Everything set up. You got everything set up. It's time to S Tech people. I'm going to show you my method and what I do and what I exactly write down, okay? Okay, yeah, so this is how I normally set up my, uh, uh, my S Techs. Uh, I know it's handheld G camera, but like, oh well. So, right here would be the effective attacks, right? So we have one, two, three, four. So these would be the four effective attacks. Here would be the two traps. And here would be the four magic card control keeps falling. And then this here would be the fusions. So you would have like one effective attack, two, three, four. And then when you use your two traps, and then when you place down and use your magics, boom, that's like four. And then fusions would be like one, two, one, two. You have this completed, and this would be like Pegasus uh, 17, or like Isis, like two, Kaiba three. There you go. You should have an ATEC after filling out a chart like that. So remember to set it up your chart like I showed you. Uh, so it would be like Pegasus 15. Nothing as, uh, again. All right, so when you have this kind of hand, Put down a Dark Magician, he's drunk. Alright, well, at least be because Dark Magician is out on the field, we can just hammer him until. And we just put down like random magic, so that's like one magic. Drop that down. Let's put another magic down. It's two. Damn, dude, what the fuck? Okay, um... This fuse is right? Yep. One fuse. And let's just... So he should kill that, and then we should get one effective attack. Yep. One effective attack. Coming right up! Nice, and we got first trap. Set that down, jot that. Take that out. Yo, we're gonna get something good this run. I feel it. I feel it in my bones! Alrighty. I think we should make a thunderhead here. Yeah. One, two. See, this is like a regular deck with like a regular game. Okay, so both of my trap cards are right here on the field. Now is the opportune time to get your effective attacks in, in my opinion. Let's use this uh, one-eyed shield dragon, because I don't like dragons that only have one eye. Cool. So now we're just gonna hammer him. Take a shot. Ooh. Fuck you. We got one on the field, we can use some fu uh, fusions now. Let's do, let's do two more. That's four or five, so we're five fusions deep. Cool. We'll just hit him for some. And that's gonna be our second trap card activated next turn. Suck up! Magic card. Alright, so now we gotta do three. Ooh, three effective attacks and put down some magic cards and get some fusions and we're done. It's two effective attacks. Uh, you still can't kill that. That's probably another... That's probably something shitty. Um... Done magic card. Uh, so... Boom, boom, boom. Uh, oh, it's only like 600, nice. nice, nice. Alright, it's three effective attacks. 
So now we just have to uh, get our magic cards, and that's it. And then we can kill them. All right. So that, now, now we should shuffle. All right. Let's get one more effective attack in, just so I can get it out of my system. Boom. And that's ten. So anything more is just bonus. Great. All right, now let's, uh, let's toss some shit. One, two, three. Let's do wasteland. Okay. So we can use up three more cards. I can't make anything with these guys because they're assholes, but we can do this and then see if we don't have any other cards to play. Okay, so we're pretty much in the clear. What? Okay. Yeah, so we're pretty much in the clear. Um, now we're just gonna scrap. Scrape, scrape. The last three cards in my deck, see what they are. See if I can use them. No. Let's do one more fusion. For shits and giggles. And... Not so marvelous. Haha, <laughs> okay. And bam, that was like eight minutes. Eight minutes and if you look, I never got the, the fucking crush card. I never get the fucking crush card. It's my first time. Oh shit, dude. Real feels good moment, man. Okay, so it took us 18 turns to win right here, right? Um, normally, uh, if you're like trying to get the first trap card um, from Kaiba, it's gonna take you like like all all the turns. So like how many turns? So this is like a, a the re so you gotta do the regular Stex. Um, from Kaiba, like the old way, and that should take about 30 minutes about per duel, which sucks, I know. But once you get one trap card, you can use this uh, method, and it's like 8 minutes. So it's like, so much more efficient, so much faster. This helped me so much, guys. I just got a fucking crush card because uh, of it. I hope you guys get a fucking crush card uh, from this method at one point. If you need any help or anything, uh, please let me know. Thank you for joining me on this knowledge quest. Uh, and we made it, guys. We're here. All right, guys, hope you have a great day, great year, great month, great week. Take care. We'll see you soon. Bye.